So I just bought tickets to LA and that is because I am going to the Elton John Oscars after party, which sounds like a lot of fun. So I'm going tomorrow. This year is all about just going for shit. I do that pretty much always actually, but when it comes to trips, actually, I'm lying to you. I do this all the fucking time. I actually take more trips last minute than I do when I plan them. Like I, I actually love to do this. And every time I do it, I'm like, this is so spontaneous and fun. And then I'm like, Brad, you literally do this every single time. Like you actually never plan trips because it's more fun that way. Makes life a little more zesty. Tonight I have to do all my work and get a fucking outfit. <laughs> What am I gonna wear? <laughs> I am trying to figure it out right now currently, but I will keep you updated. Fun fact, I didn't even know what the Oscars was for a second today. I knew it was an award show. I do know that. I d Saya, please. Daddy's trying to film. I now know that the Oscars is like for television and movies and like people who work on them, right? And actors and actresses, right? We will find out this weekend. And I will let you know if that's right or not. I'm sure a lot of you guys watching are like, what the fuck, Brad? The Oscars? We all know what the Oscars is. I'm a really bad gay for not knowing what that is because every gay knows every award season. I don't know shit. I don't know shit about shit. Hopefully we can get a little more educated. I'll see you at the airport or something. I don't know. Or tomorrow. I, probably when I'm stressed out packing, I'll let you know how that goes. Great. I'm on the airplane. I am about to take off. In LA, well, actually, no, I'm gonna be in LA in like six hours, so <laughs> it's so fun. Um, fun fact about me is that I don't like flying, except I've gotten better at it. I got trail mix, the seasoned kind, because who gets the original? It's too, too flavorless for me. But I am excited to dig into this vegan goodness that they're about to serve me on this flight. Like, I really, please tell me it's good. Please, please be good. I usually fly JetBlue, so I'm cheating on JetBlue right now, and um, I'm interested to see what we got going on. I should be a fucking a flight reviewer. I really like it. Like, I've... What the fuck? I just said I hate flying, and now I want to be a flight reviewer. Like, that doesn't make any sense. So, I'm in Valencia right now, and... <laughs> I found this really cool suit, but it does not fit me at all. If this is just the pants on, but guys, it's an inside out suit. So it's like really fucking cool, but um, this doesn't uh, fit me at all. So <laughs> this isn't gonna work. On to the next store. Damn it, bro. These would have been sick. And if they had the matching blazer, that's inside out too. And it's like, Balenciaga print all over it. I don't know. It's not meant to be, you know? So, fuck my life. <laughs> I know I look ugly. I mean, I look very straight in this. Um, and <laughs> there are no suits anywhere because of the Oscars, uh, which I expected, but like, I didn't expect the, it to be this bad. Like this is, this is the best we can do right now. And I can't even get this shit tailored. <laughs> Somebody help me. Somebody help me. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? No, I mean, not with this shirt, but like, N to the fucking, no. This is not an outfit, so don't judge it. <laughs> I don't know what this is. <laughs> I think I'd wear no shirt underneath. I mean, honestly, the top part is kind of cute. Hmm. Okay, update. I was in uh, Saint Laurent for a really long time. This amazing guy, shout out to Chase at the Beverly Hill. Uh, what is it? Beverly Hills location. 
Are Rodeo we Drive. Rodeo Drive location. Um, you're amazing. Thanks, Chase. And uh, I think I found an outfit. It's definitely a little more casual than I was thinking, but it's really cool. Very Saint Laurent, very sexy, and it might be the vibe. Yes, I'm wearing the same thing I wore two days ago. But in my defense, I only wore it on the flight. I also packed an overweight 55 pound piece of luggage with um, like three different suits, about 10 different shirts, three different pairs of jeans, five pairs of shoes. And am I going to wear any of that? No. And will I keep wearing the same shirt every day I'm here? Yes. So anyways, today is the Oscar party day. I'm going to get my nails done and I don't know what I want to do to my nails. I want them black, I know that. I don't know if I should get a design on them. <sighs> I have difficult nails, okay? They're probably, they're really ugly right now. So like, don't, don't come for me. But usually when they do them, they have to really do them right or else they get even uglier. If you've ever gotten your nails done in your life, you know that some people are better than others. And I have no idea who this person today is doing my nails. So <sighs> good fucking luck to me. I might just do black just to keep it simple because there's no worse thing I could imagine happening than asking for a design and it just looking so fucking bad that I have to go and take them off when I get home. So there's my answer. I'm not doing a design. Today is not the day to risk it. I did find my outfit yesterday, by the way. Oh, oh, ooh. Is that leather? Oh my God, that's all you get to see, sorry. Am I gonna be the sluttiest guy there in this outfit? Yes. There's a lot of skin showing, you'll see uh, later. I also worked out today, so that was fun. I'm feeling a little like, Arr. I'm feeling a pump going on. <gasps> feeling the testosterone, baby. Fuck with me, fuck with me, bitch. All right, I'm gonna be late. <laughs> Listen, I walked by a Trader Joe's. I had to get some shit, you know what I mean? Like, first of all, I don't know why, I was just craving these fucking mangoes and obviously always craving Synergy Gingerade. That's my Trader Joe's haul for today. And I know that I'm the only one who walks in LA, but I just can't help it. I can't fucking help it, okay? It's the New Yorker in me. It, it just wants to walk. Look at this weather. How could I not walk? This is super awkward. People are staring at me. I don't like it. Okay. <laughs> Somebody, please. I have zero clue where I am. I should probably get back and start getting ready. I take 10 fucking minutes to get ready. What, who am I kidding? What, what do I have to do? Literally nothing. Oh, by the way, by the way, I got my nails done. We went with black. They're actually really pretty. He did a great job. Shout out to Kevin. And it took like five minutes and it was great. I hate waiting to get my nails done. I'm like, can you fucking hurry up? But Kevin slayed it. It was also really inexpensive, so that was nice. Wait, this is kind of aesthetic. Should I take a picture here? Be like, Trader Jules. 
know what I mean. Like, hold on, that's like an Instagram picture. I took a shower. I'm smelling good. Uh, um, it's time to get ready. No, this is not the outfit for tonight. I also, I just want to tell everybody that I uh, forgot my purple shampoo. So uh, your boy's gonna have some yellow fucking hair tonight. <laughs> you know, so I do just pretend it's white and not yellow. Thank you. I'm feeling excited. I am ready to fucking party, bitch. Woo! Um, I might have a little cocktail right now. I can't decide though. We gotta pace ourselves or else shit's gonna get too wild. You know, when you're around famous people <laughs> all night and very successful people, you know, it's not a great idea to get wasted. Will I get wasted? I don't know. Okay, we, I don't know what's going to happen, okay? It's fine, I'm a very friendly drunk, so it's cute, it'll be cute. The hair was looking bad, I had to, I had to cover it up. Fun fact about me, I hate getting my makeup done. I do my own makeup for events, like, which isn't crazy, but like every single time I go somewhere, they're like, do you wanna get your makeup done? And I'm like, no. <laughs> because I go from boy to drag queen, Way too quick. It is like two seconds and I'm a drag queen. I'm like, whoa, let's calm down with the concealer, please. You know, so we don't do that anymore. I'm putting primer on my chest because I'm going to put makeup all over my body. <laughs> Ooh, my tits look good. Also, I'm going to get you onto some shit right now. Neutrogena Hydro Boost, bitch. Bitch, it is so good. I was using like high-end makeup for the longest time for my foundation. And um, let me tell you, this drugstore shit got me fucked up. If you like a literal, like your skin to look naturally perfect, ooh, this is, this is it. Wait, you know how I always say to not wrap your hair in a towel? <laughs> <laughs> now I'm wrapping my hair in a towel. It's only because I just don't want to look ugly right now. And just like that, the makeup is done. I did like a dewy skin, perfect skin moment, you know? And I feel cute. It'll all come together, you know what I mean? Like once the hair is there, once the outfit's there, it'll be great. I feel cute, I feel good. This is a good sign. When the makeup goes well, the night will go well. I'm manifesting that, so. I forgot to show you guys, but I'm putting in electric rain. Oh, wait. <laughs> Electrified volume foam. Uh, I put it in my hair, literally like this. And then I'm taking this really shitty Conair blow dryer that literally doesn't work. And I'm going like this with my hands and putting heat on it. There's like no heat in this, but um, it gives me these like kind of natural looking waves. I want my hair to look really textured and like, lived in and like really slutty because that's the vibe for tonight slutty oscars i just want to look like i didn't try <laughs> and obviously no look of mine is ever complete without bdsm slick and define bomb i use it for every fucking thing in life it's the best product in the world this will give me like that pc texture but it'll also hydrate my hair at the same time i like my shit moisturized i like it shiny especially this fucking blonde hair Bam, it looks like I slept on my hair for three days and didn't wash it. It's a good sign. Glam, check. Now I gotta put that outfit on, bitch, and pick out jewelry. Mm. Ah, my favorite part. Ah. Sorry, but I look good, sorry. I'm like, hello? Is, is the party over, is it over here? Or is it over there? Uh, Okay, it's here. Yeah, cool. I'm trying to decide what the vibe is with the jewelry. I have this like pearl necklace. It looks like this. Or I have like this vibe. 
you know, kind of cute, kind of cute. Or I could do this, which is like long, you know what I mean? But like for now, bitch, I like hot. I'm also wearing leather pants. So it's very like BDSM-y, which is like obviously always the vibe. Eh. Okay, I'm getting nervous. I gotta go back. Christopher, you ready? Yeah, which you You're gorgeous, honey. You sure this jacket is the right one? Gorgeous, darling. Let's do it. I'm terrified. I'm not orange. White. One no, of us is really white. One of us is off. You're either really white or I'm really orange. Something is going on. And we're really about white. to find out where these bitches got on the internet. It's the next day. I'm exhausted. I'm going home. Last day was a lot of fun. Thanks for following along on the journey. <laughs> I ended up loving my outfit, loving the whole look. The pictures came out so cute. Go check them out on Instagram. And uh, yeah, I need a nap. Ugh, what a weekend. So that's it. If you guys wanna check out more videos, you can do that. Or you can shop my hair care, my hair color line, link down below. And um, that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to live your extra life. And I'll see you next time. Bye.